This is a four ingredient, no fail, bush damper in a camp oven video. G'day, it's Gay. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to make yummy bush damper using four ingredients. Self-raising flour, icing sugar, salt, and water. So we're just gonna fill up the, what do you call this thing? It's empty of the bag. I want you to focus on the pot. Just before I get started, the videographer, we've got a video, oh, what do you call them? A videographer, I think you're oh. right. Let me introduce you to today's video, videographer. <laughs> videographer, that's video. Ographer. Ographer. Let me introduce you to today's videographer. <laughs> what? It's nothing, because now you're like videographer. Go on. Let me introduce you to today's videographer. Spin the camera around please, video person. Woo! So we're adding the flour in the pot. Got that videographer? I have. I got distracted. Oh, one escaped. <laughs> For this part we're keeping the heat low. And what we want to do is get the what we want to do is get this flour to go a bit crackly and when that's ready then the pot's ready to the damper's ready to be added so we've got the flour going so why we've got that going is to find out where the hot spots are in the camp oven you'll see if it's too hot there'll be either a black or a brownish spot and either you can move the heat bead around or you can what you can you do or you, <laughs> or you can add a little bit more flour to it as well that helps but when it's all crackly and we'll show you that later that's when it's ready but while that's while the flour is getting ready now we're going to make the damper so two cups Two cups of two cups of self-raising flour. A little bit of salty, salty. Oh, maybe a bit more. <laughs> yeah. Tablespoon. So I normally do. This is the icing sugar. So I sort of do. That looks about right. And a bit more. <laughs> That's how we do that. It's like a real cook's measure. Yeah. You sort of got to guesstimate a bit. So we'll do that. And now, uh, my special knife, my favorite knife. It is now. We mix it in a bit first. And then we've got our water. And we start adding just a bit of water at a time a little bit now, we've nearly got it into one big ball so when all these little crummy bits come together is when we're good to go there's a little bit of water Now see how when I move the knife around, it's just sort of following the knife. That's how when we know that it's all good to go. So I sort of just puncture it a little bit. Move it around a little bit again. And that's pretty much it. That's our damper, ready to go, almost. 
So now what I do, put in a little bit of flour on my hands and we can pick it up and now we put it into the shape that we sort of want it in. So I sort of do it in a little bit flat because if you go too high it'll burn the top. We did that the first time, not this time. That's pretty good. Don't don't want to play with it too much. Just leave it like that. And then I get my knife and I give it a little bit of a serrated knife. I give it a little bit of a cut. So Carol and I have the same portions. Yep. And then I just sit hit him in there. And then we'll go and see. Now that the damp is ready and we've got that all good to go, we'll go and see how the flower's going and So we can see the crackling starting. I think that's pretty good. We can now go ahead and put our damp in. The thing is with where we are filming this at the moment, it is very cool. We did add another heat bead. So we've got our damper in now. And we'll check him again in 20 minutes. I think there's too many. Oh, no, that'd be fine. You piled it on the last time you did it, wouldn't you? Yeah. Film with the pot. You don't need the pot, do you? No. I don't need the pot. Thanks for your autographer. The video autographer has gone again. So now we've got the damper uh, cooking away. So I've added a lot, lot more beads to the top of the... Uh, what do you call it? I've added a lot more beads to the top of the... What? Oven. Camp oven. Uh, this is so that you can get more heat coming down from the top. So you don't want as much heat coming from underneath. I'm using heat beads because I find them easier to be able to control the heat. You can use fire, fire, what is it called? Coal. You can use coals. Uh, that is going to be variable depending on what sort of wood you use to burn off to get your coals with. So that's pretty much it how I do it. What else do I want to say? This is not my recipe. I've used a recipe from a fellow called King Brown. He's got quite a few recipes up on his channel, so I'll put a link down below for that as well. You can go check him out. So that's a recipe that I used. Yeah, it's definitely cooled down. My beak's cold. Mm. I can't sit stand here all night doing this. It'd be warm though. Have a look at now. Yeah. Oh. Video grapher. Alright, we've got to smudge some of these away. Videographer. Just saying. Video grapher. Grapher? <laughs> oh my goodness. Alright. Alright. Grand reveal. 20 minutes. Fingers crossed. Oh, look at that. What did we think? A little bit longer? Yeah. A little bit longer? Yep. All right, let's do five. Five minutes. Five minutes? Yeah. Camera person's right to go. We can smell it. Yeah, it smells good. Oh, nommy nom. Yeah, it looks good. Yeah. Skewer. No sticky. Nice one. Sounds good. Yep. We're good to go. Uh, so now what? Now we um, eat it. <laughs> <laughs> i got to get rid of the coals. How are you going to do that? Well, I've got a lid lifter, you see. How does that work? Well, you see, I just take it and I go over here and I hold it and then I, oops, <laughs> I'll do it this way for the camera person, oops, the is going to be cooked, <laughs> no, there we go, flowery, it smells like damper, I hope it tastes like it, 
Yeah. So there we go. Hot, hot, hot. Damper, ready to go. How yeah. does that look? Doesn't look doughy. Doesn't look doughy? Maybe a little bit longer. But... I think it looks alright. It's hot. You can see the steam coming out. Hot. Yeah, it was hot. What's in your mouth? Mm -hmm. <laughs> nice on a cool day, cool day in, out in the Victorian high country. Yeah, we have butter. Mm. Alright, so there's my butter. Jam. There's a spoon in there. So yeah, oh, we've got a spoon. Well, it's a long spoon. I thought it might be better than getting jammy fingers. So it goes butter, jam, cream. Not yeah. buttered cream, jam. No. If anyone has any different opinions. Right. That's our four ingredient, no fail, bush damper. Now I've watched hours and hours and hours of videos on how to make damper and not one of them is the same as the other one they've all been different there's been various combinations the majority are probably using things like plain flour bicarb baking soda and what was the last thing yeah <laughs> and beer <laughs> nearly forgot beer you're nearly finished. I am. Nommy nom. How were they? Good. Good, 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 good. Really, really nommy. Nice crunchy top. But... Did you get paid to do a review? I get paid not always. <laughs>